And a shooting on the way to school, another at home. RTV 6's Stephanie Wade is in this east side neighborhood hearing from people and shining a light on efforts underway now to help the community. Neighbors tell me tonight they are tired of the violence. The two-year-old is expected to be okay after being shot in the wrist at this home off of Michigan and Sherman Drive. A two-year-old baby. I can only imagine what that mother is going through. A violent morning on Indy's east side. Within two hours, a two-year-old and a 17-year-old were shot just blocks from each other. Having a nine-year-old son herself, Kelly Saldivar, who lives nearby, says, I hope and pray that it's never him. I hope and pray that it's never any child. But there are efforts to help catch kids before they fall. We come from the struggle. We bred by the struggle. We, this is out of necessity. Shane Shepard founded Before You Fall to help people struggling in the community, especially kids. These young black kids, they grew up in war-torn environments where they go to funeral after funeral after funeral after funeral with no help. He teaches kids in an after-school program from all across the city. I got them from 42nd and Post Road. They got a sign seat, so I know where you're from. That the violence they see spill out on the streets, or in this case, even at home. This is in every neighborhood in Indianapolis. Police can't do nothing about it. The detectives can't do nothing about it. Stems from other problems. Poverty, lack of jobs, undereducation, uh, lack of care, and in hopelessness. This program gives kids the support, the community, and the skills to take charge of their own lives before they fall. Hope is in here. Um, it's not me, it's not Ms. Majors, it's not the chief of police. It got to start inside of self, then you got to go out and find the things that you need to get better. Working for you, Stephanie Wade, RTV6. Thanks, Steph. And to get involved in Before You Fall, we will attach a link on our website at theindychannel.com.